right, I am at the Newcastle County location for the Delaware Adolescents Program Incorporated, and I have the pleasure of sitting with Danita Moore, who is the Newcastle County Center Director, and Doris Griffin, who is the Executive Director um, statewide for the Delaware Adolescents Program Inc., otherwise known as DAPI for some of you. Hi, ladies, how are you today? Hi. Hi, how are you? I am very well. It's such a pleasure to get to meet you. Listen, you guys have been in existence for quite some time, but exactly how long? We started actually in November 1968. Woo wee! Yes. Oh my gosh. Listen, that's quite a lengthy tenure. Yes, it is. Indeed. And it's, it's so funny. So I'm a Delaware native and I'm from the north side of Wilmington. And I remember being an adolescent myself hearing about DAPI and hearing older people talk about DAPI um, in different situations, you know, oh, you know, you'll go to DAPI if you, you know, mm -hmm. those kinds of uh, stigmas. But I, I, to dispel the stigma of what DAPI is or stands for, growing up, um, I would hear DAPI is a place where pregnant teens, pregnant adolescents go, um, like to hide during pregnancy, but I know that that's not what DAPI is really all about. So. Tell me, I'm not, either one of you can take this one, but tell me, what is DAPI really here for? Danita, why don't you take that? So, I like to put it very plainly as we have in our mission. Um, we provide standards-based education mm -hmm. for pregnant and parents and teens. We have unique outreach, mentor, and supportive services that do what? They empower and mm -hmm. um, provide self-sufficiency skills for nice. our young ladies when they graduate. Very nice, very nice. So help me to understand, and to all of our viewers as well, how does DAPI work? Well, it starts with um, a young person saying yes to the fact that they have gotten pregnant. Okay. And then the decision has to be made that they know the importance of their education. Mm -hmm. Another yes. That's and a big one. Absolutely. And so we are available at that point to receive the referral or maybe they will call us directly and we'll work with the home school okay. for, for that young lady to come with us for a time. Mm -hmm. And we will continue her education, be it middle school or high school, or she's a senior, mm -hmm. so that she can continue on her academic journey while also learning about what it means to be a mom mm. and to begin to seriously focus about the productivity needed in becoming a productive citizen in our great state. I love it, I love it. So. Um, you know, to be become a statistic, being a teen parent or an adolescent parent, um, you know, that could be very stifling in a young one's life growing up. Um, you know, there's so much responsibility in becoming a parent. What kind of enrichment do you guys provide these adolescents to help them understand parenting while staying on track with their education and not being a statistic? So some of the things that we do, first of all, we call our students Daffy Daughters. Mm -hmm. They are just like our own daughters. Mm -hmm. And so we try to provide them with um, community partners who come in to teach them everything from how to cook, how to um, take care of themselves as a young mother, mm -hmm. and their child. So we make sure that they have the life skills and the tools that they are going to need when they walk out that door. Nice. That's really nice. Okay, alrighty. So, um, for the young ladies, the Dappy daughters, yes. and this is just, this is for females who have discovered that they're pregnant and, like you said, want to continue with their education being a main priority as well as learning how to become a uh, better parent. Uh, what about the males? Is there something for the males? Yes, we are interested in the entire young family. Okay. And so we have an outreach, a very strong outreach mm -hmm. that is supported by the Department of Public Health in their Healthy Women, Healthy Baby program. Okay. Uh, we provide a program called Adolescent Parenting Connection. All right. And so we are working with young women and young men mm -hmm. regarding relationship building. Because what better way than to learn whether you are a pregnant teen or parenting father you need to know how to develop a healthy relationship. And with that comes a series of workshops and activities mm -hmm. in reference to how to work as a productive adult in relationship with wow. other people. That's awesome. So I'm really curious, and um, uh, you know, we just went through a very major, 
major pandemic that we're still experiencing effects yes. of. Um, was your enrollment affected in some way by the pandemic? Yes, it was. It was impacted mm -hmm. severely, particularly in our Kent County location. Okay. And what we have prefaced to do in this season is uh, no longer rely upon our wonderful partnering schools statewide, okay. but to go directly to our constituents and talk about the power that exists within the Delaware Adolescent Program Incorporated. We are here to empower young people to be able to stand and produce. Just because they said yes to being a parent does not mean it's the end of their world. Yeah, that's really important for them to know. Yes. Indeed. Um, I think that's so awesome. So uh, what can our viewers learn from you today to know how they can get involved, especially those who are eager to serve and wanting to volunteer, um, understanding that you're going straight to the constituents? What can we do? There are a lot of things you can do. Um, you can visit us on our website at daffy.org and you will find a, a tab for volunteering and for mentoring. We've taken it to the 21st century. You can apply online, mm -hmm. and we have um, a database that allows us to connect the mentor with the mentee. There is training involved to help the mentor mm -hmm. discover the skills that they need to nurture the young person along the way. They're not there to tell them what to do, but mm -hmm. to help them to build the dream of a career or college opportunity. Very nice. Awesome. So that's daffy.org if you are interested in learning more about volunteering. Uh, ladies, I really appreciate your time. Thank you so much. I think it's super important for our viewers to understand what Daffy is all about, you know, dispelling any rumors that there may be, and also bringing encouragement and enlightenment to any adolescents so they can understand that it's not just you. It's something that is, it happens to others too and there are resources to help you. So again, I thank you for your time. Thank you. And we're gonna go back over to the studio.